guys in this video we want to look at bing's test which is our tuning fork test so basically <clears throat> we are looking at hearing tests to assess the hearing right so in that you have lot of types of um, tests you have clinical tests in which you have the finger friction test watch test speech test right under the tuning fork test you have the bing's test so it's a tuning fork test other than this you have lot of other tests like audiometric tests and then you also have the special tests okay in this we are looking only at the bing's test now bing's test is a tuning fork test it's a clinical test right it's a test for bone conduction you're going to test the bone conduction <clears throat> and you will examine the effectiveness of occlusion of ear canal so you will uh, what happens when you occlude the ear canal that is what you're checking so how will you occlude the ear canal here so inside this you have the ear canal you will try to occlude it with the tragus itself right so here you have the tragus by pressing the tragus you will occlude the ear canal okay so you will keep the tuning fork where you will take a vibrating tuning fork right and place it on the mastoid you will place it where on the mastoid right now with the so now with the tragus that this is the tragus what they will do they will the tuning fork is here guys don't forget the tuning fork is here now with the tragus they will occlude the ear canal let us say they occlude it that means they close the ear canal that time they will hear better who will hear better normal people will hear better when it is occluded because you are checking what the bone conduction okay then if they open uh, the occlusion is removed so basically this was occluded right when it is occluded they are hearing well when it is not occluded and is absolutely free that time the hearing is less this is in normal people so this is called as bing's positive okay this is called as called as bing's positive wherever you are seeing this occluded that time he is able to bone conduction he is able to hear well when he uh, you are not occluding it he he's hearing less this is positive this is positive bing's test and positive is good right so this is yet another test where positive is good in medical science right but this positive happens in who all it happens in normal people and in people with sensory hearing loss bing's test positive means it is normal or they have sensory neural hearing loss okay so why we are able to hear better is because here you are checking bone conduction not air conduction so basically you can occlude the ear canal right you you don't need the air conduction here you are checking the bone conduction okay so positive bing's positive is in normal people now a patient who has conductive hearing loss there will be no change okay bing negative if a person has bing negative means what bing negative means there is conductive hearing loss so basically conductive hearing loss means the external auditory canal occluded or not occluded doesn't makes difference to him probably it is already occluded he has conductive hearing loss so he is absolutely not able to appreciate any difference okay so that is being negative that's it guys about uh, bing's test bing's test is a tuning fork test you're checking bone conduction so you're using the tragus to occlude the ear canal if a guy has conductive deafness obviously what will happen he will not appreciate any difference that's all guys bye for now Thank you.